this is just a quick follow-up video to my last one for all those that believe in the ball earth that we're spinning on a ball that's traveling at a thousand miles an hour at the equator what do you base it upon a bunch of teachers that told you your whole life that we live on a ball have any of these teachers viewed the the supposed ball from space absolutely not they're just teaching that they've been told only governments have been out in space people need to wake up and realize we all have been born into deception very few can find their way out of it just look at NASA's logo what do you see that forked tongue just like a serpent just like Satan and this government agency just like the psyops in the news NASA is nothing more than a psyop as well of course just realize everything we've been told from evolution to us living on a spinning ball to the news that we receive daily on CNN is nothing but a lie people need to unplug from all the lies that they feed us and realize things in this world are nothing what it seems I just saw the video of Blue Origin's rocket launch it's a complete joke nothing but CGI fakery mixed with some real people interacting on the ground but overall nothing but garbage take a look at the footage nothing but fakery nothing but CGI that's all they will give us Check good. Forward fin check good. Half spin check good. LGS check good. Ready for flight. T minus 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Command engine start. 2, 1. Ignition. And liftoff. CC detects separation. She just said CC detects separation. And CC is code for 33. This is nothing more than a Masonic hoax, a PSYOP. PM confirmed separation. Complete garbage, fakery, CGI. What is this crap? Nothing but garbage. People get excited over this watching a video game all you're watching Drone parachute deploy main parachute deploy they do here I'm not saying this is absolutely fake with the parachutes in this pod here but you know this is how they do it. they edit they edit parts of the film of course all you saw was CGI in the beginning they might again you know how to parachute bring down this capsule but nonetheless this is complete garbage complete fakery and like I said the end result is there's gonna be some type of you know basically something that goes wrong and they're gonna have to scrap this entire program this is what it's all about this is NASA you know basically the the shuttle missions are no longer happening they got to keep the dream of space alive and you know just a few seconds of the fake ball earth that CGI garbage that they showed us Touchdown. PMs at 20,000 feet now this is complete garbage deploy. here Estimate 10 seconds until engine restart how this thing comes straight down out of space and stays in position doesn't you know wobble and how it comes down for a perfect landing it's a complete joke 12,000 feet 5,000 feet engine starting we have thrust Reminds me watching a movie. LGS deploy. Fake sound feet, effects. Seven feet per second. And where's the, like I said, where's the amateur footage for this? 
you know, this Blue Origin project, you only get the footage directly from them. What about any amateur footage or any other people taking footage of this? Not buying it for a second. Touchdown. Engine stop. Fake CGI flames. Watching a movie. Well, let's break down this footage with the supposed celebration after the Blue Origin landed. Well, everybody's focusing on the people celebrating this fake phony celebration, just like this fake phony rocket launch and landing. Here's the issue. Where are the burnt marks from the thrust? There are none. And don't tell me they dragged the Blue Origin to this location to capture this footage for the celebration. Complete garbage. Again, this is all they can give us. Nothing but fakery. Take a look. There you go. Perfect landing. Yeah, perfect landing. history today. I'm sure you did. All we get is this junk they give us. Complete propaganda. People see it. You know, anything on CNN? provided by NASA or any of these big companies like I said with Richard Branson that project was scrapped and the same thing is going to happen with this project you're going to see something go wrong and they're going to say we have to scrap the project completely ridiculous people believe the moon landing nearly 50 years later this is all we get you know it's a complete joke I'm going to show a little bit of a close-up you can see there's absolutely no no residue from the supposed rocket thrusters and again, taking a look at underneath the rocket, at the asphalt, you don't see any burn marks from the thruster rocket. All you see is basically shadows from this rocket itself. It's basically nothing more than a prop. That's all it is. Complete fakery, complete garbage, 100% exposed. What's taking place reminds me with this scene from They Live with the Preacher Man, what he says. All that's taking place in this world with the government and the rich and powerful which are recruited to take part in the deception that's taking place all part of the matrix. Take a listen. It's only a few seconds long. It completely adds up to what's taking place in this world. They have recruited the rich and the powerful and they have blinded us to the truth. 100% truth. Like I said so many times, truth in movies lies in the news. Is if nobody tells you a, that it's an illusion or nobody brings your attention to it, then how are you going to know? Space, the final frontier. Space may be the final frontier, but it's made in a Hollywood basement. Fascinating, fascinating, fascinating. 